Janelle is live. Okay. Welcome in, everybody. I'm Janelle Sherman, and I'm the designer and owner of Started Jewelry. So we have a new platform of how we are doing our shows. So welcome in. Um, this is supposed to be much easier to shop. Um, we're going to be touring the jewelry tonight. Um, we are still on our celebration of 30 years. And so I have been doing this for 30 years, which is just amazing. So um, we're going to have some goodies that at the end of the show we're going to be drawing for. So guess what? Um, that is a $10 gift certificate. And we're going to give away three because it's three decades. So three at $10, that's going to be $30. Okay. And guess what? We are also, you're going to be entered into a drawing if you purchase today during our show or until midnight. Okay. We're 1159. You are also going to be entered into winning my favorite Janelle Adair three for three decades. Um, and we're going to be giving three of my diamond rings away. Okay. So anyway, we'll be doing a tour of the diamond ring because that is for sale. And um, what else do we have? Because I can't wait to get we, away some. We so, also have yeah. Janelle 30 still. <gasps> okay. And that is, you're going to save $30 if you spend $175 in a single okay. order, excluding any of the new arrivals, pre-sales, or last chance. Okay. So, but anything else? So on shop website? away, ladies. But we want your feedback. We want to see your comments in this entire thing. And I think our format is first. We're not even going to show you how to show yeah. it because it should be easy as hitting on what we're going to be showing you at the time. So we've got a team here. We're going to be touring the jewelry as we do that. But let's go to the trade because I would love to show what we're going to start with. And we're going to start with some really beautiful black sultry colors. Um, we have actually on the tray a brand new debut snowflake obsidian ring, which I cannot wait because, ladies, you saw the multi-bracelet that we had. Um, just beautiful things. I've got a couple of my barrel station pieces. Um, and guess what? Um, those have the diamonds inlaid into them too. And we have that really long station necklace, um, in the Janelle Adair that is on our website also. Um, but we will be taking each of these items and we're going to be showing one by one here coming up. So, um, we're going to get started. Okay. So I am again, so grateful that you're here and i um, so thankful. So if you have questions, um, we do have a slew of our amazing team members that are going to actually um, come and help you and answer your questions. So if you have any questions at all, please um, bring out the feed, but remember you're going into a drawing at the end of the show. Okay. So we are giving away three, three, Okay, three ten dollars certificates. All you have to do is make a comment in the feed. So, and I have somebody entering your name in as you're doing that, um, and then we'll at the end of the show do a big spinner on it. Okay, so um, our first item up is the Janelle Adair diamond. Okay, so with this, um, I designed. I, I know a lot of you ladies have my uh, barrel station necklaces with the handmade chain. I really felt like I wanted to bring something elevated. So what I did is I brought the barrel in and I decided to use the diamonds. Now remember, Sarah, don't we use like, we don't use commercial quality diamonds, no, right? No, not just any diamonds. So we're gonna use uh, GH in color, so they're gonna be near colorless, uh, SI, in, uh, sorry, SI in clarity, so you're not gonna see any visible inclusions in there. Um, and then a full 58 facet, so a full round brilliant cut. I love that. See, ladies, like so we were pretty. born to love diamonds. And um, anyway, you will have my magnet enhancer, which is wonderful because ladies that are busy on the go, I love to put just different features that are just really easy. Also, too, you know, you don't want to have to take the whole necklace off and then string it off the necklace. It's just a lot of time, right, that we save. Um, and mm -hmm. um, I'm going to also have the matching earrings also. So, um those are really, really cute. And I think what I'll do is I started with the Janelle Adair hoops on. Um, but what I can do too is um, we can flip back and I would definitely be able to try some of these things on. I figured what we would do is kind of stop in between and I'll show a couple of those items on also. Um, I guess I should have looked at doing those first. We're, we're figuring this out because I'm thinking <laughs> I probably should have put the barrel. Didn't I grab for those first? Because I was like, oh, my diamond. And mm -hmm. then I thought, the display's so cute, I don't want to wreck it. So I left them. 
and I uh, did the hoops. I love these. They're so cute. Well, and they're double-sided. So Bali, the beads, I, we used to call them Bali beads. That's what brought me to Bali. And what is so special about Bali is they still handmade jewelry. Like people don't do that. So even if there's any casting um, part of our process, we have waxes. Every single one of them of a piece has to be hand carved still. So it's it's not like where machines are spitting them out and then we're putting them on a tree and casting. Each one is still done individually. Um, so it's literally like we are bench making your jewelry. Like if you go to a jeweler, they're making those pieces one by one. I love them. Um, okay, so um, you know I'm big on tip to tip bracelets. So um, this is our tip to tip. They're 14 by 10s, and those are black spinels. And I don't do any kind of regular fastening. Mm -hmm. You're going to see it's literally a scalloped edge that is micro faceted on the edge of that stone. But if you look, it's called a table. The table has a beautiful picture of literally the flatness of that stone. So it's it, you're, you're getting scalloping on the edge of the stone. But then you can see that really beautiful pattern in the stone where it's scalloped onto the top. So again, I want to give you elevated pieces. I want to give you those forever pieces. Like, do you know, I do, you know, I was talking about last week, ladies, remember I had my black silk blouse on and they got bleach on it. These are, these are going to be those classic pieces you're never going to get rid of in your jewelry box, right? Um, they're just those really great uh, pieces. Oh, we actually didn't get your size, did we? Oh yeah, we'll have to figure that out. Um, actually, I have my size, so I think what I'll do is I'll make sure that I put mine on. I like this too, because then you can layer something here if you wanted. You could bookend it. Oh yeah. So that's kind of nice. Well, and you know what, ladies, remember, you will fit into two of our bracelets, okay? So again, Tanya, this might say that this would fit your wrist, um, but then I might have a second bracelet that literally um, fits your wrist also. So if you want it roomy, like you saw mm -hmm. on um, Tanya, then you go for the bigger, okay? But if you like it a little bit more fitted, and I'll show the bracelet on myself, then you would go for the smaller one. So don't let the bracelets confuse you on that. Um, if you like them a little bit more fitted, more average, um, you would go for the smaller size. If you like it a little bit more relaxed or roomy, again, you would go for the bigger size because um, you will fit into two of our sizes, most likely. Yeah, and I love how on our website we have the perfect fit section that'll tell you, you know, if your wrist size is this and you want your bracelet to fit this way, get this size. So And each wrist so varies, you know, but we got it down pretty good, ladies, that you get at home. Um, either you, you know, sometimes like it one way or the other, um, both of them will fit you. And um, again... If not, we would love to exchange it for you too. Okay, I'm kind of excited about this because ladies, do you see something a little different? You know, this is one of my favorite pieces and it's a locket. But for the first time ever, did you see there's a magnet enhancer on it, okay? So you ladies were talking about how much you love this pendant, but you wish there was a magnet enhancer on it. It is. So anyway, you're gonna get that really beautiful um, magnet enhancer. Um, this pendant, why is so special too, um, would be because the side. Now the side has that granulation work. So when you see those swirls of silver on the side and the little small round section, we call them jaw and beads, those are all put on by hand still, one by one. And again, that is that handcrafted jewelry. Um, when you open my lockets too, they're going to be pretty on the inside. So, um, you know, with the galleries and the finished pieces, 360 degrees, it's really important for me to have those pieces that when you're wearing them, you know they're crafted so well. And again, don't forget that back gallery is my kiss to you because I want you to know every day how special and wonderful they made you are. This piece is beautiful. There's so much detail in it. And you see around the little four millimeter stones and the little pear-shaped stones, you see all those little jawline beads? Those are set by hand too. And let's talk about the bezel settings. So bezel settings, especially like the black spinel we just showed, anytime there's micro faceting around the edge and not a smooth, it that is just a lot of setting, like hand detail that we do um, still in Bali. So, yeah. Should we go on to the bracelet? Yes, 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 yes. So I have that one on. Oh my gosh. <laughs> 
your voice, Tanya. Hi. Some people recognize you. <laughs> it's Tanya. It's me today. So much mm. fun. So we love Tanya. Tanya. It's beautiful. And Tanya is the one who is responsible for all those really beautiful uh, photos on our website. Yes, and now I also have Anastasia to help, so that's wonderful. Okay, so we it, we're we're adding to our team, ladies, um, and so we you know really want to make these shows really interactive. Hey, I'm wondering um, as we're doing this, um, I love bringing in some of these multiple bracelets, ladies. So I really hope that you're starting to enjoy this. But this is the Green Moonstone, and uh, today I actually did my nails in this really beautiful cat's oh, eye. Yeah, should we show them? At Marva was like, I love it. I love your nails, but. Yeah, do you see how like it rolls? So, cool. so you see how that literally matches that uh, gray moonstone. And I love to do stones that really have this like fascinating phenomenon that goes through them all the time. That that is a word that I really always struggle with, but it's just such a cool, so, cool uh -huh. like feature. And you know, not all gemstones do that. There's some that are more common, but um, as you know, lately I've been trying to find the coon sites and aquamarines that sometimes will do that. Um, but it is pretty neat to have um, things that are natural, genuine stones that really kind of do a play of color because you'll see it go from light gray to dark gray, but that beautiful cat side that runs through. Um, but you will love the adjustability on this. And remember, all the bracelet sizing on every bracelet we have, um, we're going to tell you, know your bracelet size. So you can actually go to our website and print out uh, a bracelet sizer. But I'm telling you, if you buy something from us, please let us give you a bracelet size or free, okay? So when you're purchasing something, all you have to do is add that to your cart. You will not be charged, and we will send you the free bracelet sizer and the ring sizer. Um, it's going to give you instructions on how to use it, but I am a bracelet girl. Like, I want bracelets to feel like your second skin and feel absolutely beautiful on you, so I will continue to make those kind of bracelets for you. Beautiful. All right, should we go into the Black Star Diopside? Yes, yes. So anyway, the Black Star di Diopside is another one of those gemstones that actually, as you move it, has that cat's eye roll also. And it's really interesting because um, how these stones form and grow like that, that will do that phenomenon of, you know, showing that. So you'll see all that. Of course, I do retention closures and I do a safety press button. Okay, because I, I love to have at least two features, you know, over the years, my grandma had beautiful jewelry, but sometimes things would break. Now, you can always go and get it fixed, but I always want a secondary clasp because you never want to lose one of your favorite bracelets. So if one ever fails, you've got a second one that's going to um, stay on your wrist, right? How many earrings have we lost like that, right? Right. So no, the bracelet is not going to be one of those. And it's easy to put on and it's beautiful. And um, remember all the finished galleries, but this is how I love, you know, we start creating a really beautiful stack like that. And um, yeah, it's so, so pretty in that aspect. Oh, I love that. It looks really pretty stacked with the black spinel. Yeah. Oh my gosh. So I finally got a screen that says Melanie Green is out there. Audrey Moore, I see you. I finally, we're trying to get this set up to where I can say hi. Miss Erica, how are you? Sissy Pino, welcome in. Uh, Kristen, oh my gosh, so great to see you. Miss Amberly is out there for our first show. So uh, Linda Ricardo, she's popping in too. Annie, how you doing? Um, anyway, I'm so glad to you ladies. Um, I can't wait to see who's going to actually get my diamond ring. Mm. Uh, so Monday we will announce who wins the diamond ring. Mm -hmm. So three of my favorite diamond rings. And um, I think it's on actually the next... Uh, Oh, no. Is it not on a tray, is it? No, oh, I'm just giving it away. I'm actually wearing it. I'm actually wearing it. Wearing it. Do you want to show it? But yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So anyway, I'm going to pop this under because, ladies, it is one of, like, it's my go-to ring. You know I wear it all the time. I absolutely love it. So anyway, for my 30-year, you know, it's like the past, the present, the future. For me, it's that Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. So... Um, it is just that ring that is butter. It is just one of those really beautiful pieces. And um, I just cannot wait to see who's going to be twinning with me after I yeah. get away my name. fun. <laughs> All right. So, yes. Oh, my gosh. We, Pat, how are you doing? Teresa just popped off the screen there. Um, Miss Sandra Ruth is in the house. <gasps> Kat, oh, my gosh. So great to see you. Teresa Burrell. Okay. I could be here all day. I know. <laughs> you guys 
Yes, on star dioxide nails. Oh, uh, is it right? It is because it does kind of have that pop. Anyway, it was really interesting how those and how the gemstones form and how they actually get the nails to do this. So um, now we've got always coordinating pieces. So that is going to be one thing I will always put a coordinating piece. Now you're going to see in the show, like Tanya is doing a few of these. Um, oh, actually, that's just so interesting. I'm going to have to ask questions as we go. So are they seeing Tanya and me or just Tanya? Just Tanya. Just Tanya. Oh, okay. Yeah. Very cool. I love this because you can see. Like uh, what they're seeing. Yeah. That is cool. Oh my gosh. We'll be able to flip back and forth. So the black is your go-to. You know, that's why they say that little black dress that just will always, you know, mm -hmm. like be amazing. I love this ring for gents also. To me, you know, we're starting to slide some pieces in. Would but be perfect. I think everybody has different tastes and I don't think you have to literally dress a certain way. And that's what I love that you ladies have given me the ability to be able to design so many different things. And then I get to see how you pair it. And, and it's just so fun. I popped on today. Um, you know, I've really been doing a lot of organizing and really, you know, have not had a lot of time the last two years. And I'm really trying to get back to my routine. So, you know, I tell you, I always pop over to the Bolly Babes page. So I was laughing between Emberly and, uh, Miss Gambino. Um, it was so funny. She, she's got all her bracelets. Amberly had all her rings posted. Oh, so anyway, I love um, that. It, it's just, I, I love how you ladies are thinking of organizing. I, the jewelry box idea is there, but again, cannot get to that quality. And then when we get to the quality of the pricing, who could afford the jewelry box that I put together? So, <laughs> uh, but I will always keep um, thinking about that. I love this bracelet um, because of the look. And you know what? We're going to be showing the zigzag um, Janelle Adair ring. We finally got the ring back in on reorder, ladies. So I definitely want you to see the prices on my all silver items. Trust me, there's not much there for us, but there's tons of enjoyment for you. Yes. Um, I really try to price those as low as I can go because I know, again, those are those staple pieces that kind of elevate all your other gemstone pieces. Um, but I, I love the zigzag with that black coral, with the black spinel, you know, with the big oval. It, it just mm -hmm. snugs in there so perfectly. What do we got going on over there, Michelle? We have four sizes in the coral, and they can see that as well on the screen. That's really cool. Now you can see at the top that yeah, there are four sizes thing. available in the in the bracelet. Oh my gosh! And uh, that does look great together. Oh, so oh, it's um, oh, that is really cool. I love that. So you literally are seeing on the screen the one that um, we are showing. So Tanya, we are showing that Serene Spirit Bangle. Um, so I do, it's, you know, I call it my zigzag because it literally, I have a wave in a zigzag that I have kind of tagged. Um, we do have that in the watermark also. So if you find you love this bracelet, trust me, you probably want to come back for the watermark one too. So currently the zigzag, we do, the size seven is the one that's in stock, okay. but we do have other sizes coming soon. Yes, that's right. Yeah. Matter of fact, I put the six, uh, six and a half but I also wear the seven. I love the shape of it. The seven I use sometimes, again, you know how I was saying you can wear two sizes. When I stack a lot of bangles, to me, I love having that seven on my, mm -hmm. the, for this back towards my elbow. But you will always have, again, that retention where, and then you're always gonna hear that beautiful snap when it snaps on for you too. So um, that gives you that opportunity. Oh my gosh, I cannot believe the price on that bracelet time too. Because I, I get to see the screen now and I'm like, that is so good. Oh my gosh, it's so good. Okay, well, I'm always going to have coordinating pieces. And do you see this? I don't call it a pendant. I call it a medallion because literally um, the, the, the size of this is, it, it is just that showcase piece. Um, that is so beautiful. Matter of fact, I'm probably going to put that one on because seeing that one, it's just one of those just really showcase, really beautiful pieces. Um, after we get done showing this tray, I'm going to kind of come out and I'm going to kind of show you how to kind of coordinate some of the pieces. Now, there's no wrong way to coordinate or to stack pieces, um, but I'm going to give you kind of that further back view instead of we're giving the the close tours of it. Mm -hmm. um, this is the ring I picked to wear instantly tonight because I love a high rise statement ring. And um, this was one of those rings that I brought in for myself. I've done in other gemstones because I it, I just love it. 
Um, it's one of those ones where you walk up to somebody to talk and their, their eyes go straight to your hand, mm -hmm. you know, it's always the kind of pieces like that. And um, you're going to see that really beautiful beadwork of the little Janella dares that come up kind of over the bezel just a little bit. And that is literally, um, again, two ways to bezel set. So it's double the work. It, there's that really beautiful bezel that goes around, but then that little Janella dare comes over the bezel again on, on that side. So, you know, we never hold back. It's always just going to be, you know, work that is is gonna make that quality really good for you it's beautiful All love right. it love it this okay one. we are gonna move on to a brand new debut and gents go i uh, ladies go <laughs> okay so this is the first one that i did with the watermark and um anyway it's like a signet ring i just absolutely love it and the mm -hmm. gemstone, right, I Tanya? Like the so snowflake of obsidian. Oh my gosh! It like looks so beautiful. It is, yeah. It's one of those gemstones that is just like one of my favorites, and um, it, it is. It, it just makes such a statement. Now you saw that I pulled a snowflake obsidian ring the other day, and what I did with it was um, I picked one that had a bunch of black. Now I do more of an equal patterning like this to it. But it was one of those stones. It was all by itself. It, I, mm -hmm. I, what I would call its own little person. So I actually set that in the ring that I actually kept for myself. Yeah, this is a good one. And yeah. then there's this one too. Okay. So these are the kind of rings I love to wear. It's like a thumb ring um, mm -hmm. and the gracious heart ring. So anyway, what I kind of love like that, that scalloped heart like that, I think that just like for me, that gratitude, that, that graciousness, um, Oh, the, no, that was the other one. The t yeah, the Tranquil Beauty. Oh, this is the Tranquil, the tranquil Beauty. The Tranquil Beauty with the Janelle yes. Dare. I love that negative space there, and it is perfect for a thumb ring. And I do this in two different ways. So I actually have one that has the hammer, too, because it is so popular. But um, I've seen you ladies posting this as a thumb ring. But remember, you can always use this ring also um, just for a spacer ring. So for me, like I like a little bit smaller ring like this. Um, to stack right next to more of my statement rings or, you know, put it on your ring finger just to kind of create that that um, space or, you know, what I would say, stylizing your hand properly and balancing it. We, that one, we actually have this that starts at a size five, which is nice. We don't always have size five. I know. Yeah, I know. So it's kind of nice to have that option sometimes. We are trying to do that a little bit more, but um, this is things um, that we're starting to add notify me's on things. So, you know, on some of the really popular rings, when we start to reorder, we kind of had some discussions in house about just putting in a new size to notify to see if it would be. Um, we get five five people wanting that, then we'll move forward and uh, add it to the reorder for sure. Oh, nice! Yeah. So a lot of really great features that we're thinking about. Now this is a little bit smaller scale too. I do some larger hoops, and for me, this is why I didn't know whether to grab the barrel or. Um, this hoop because literally with this one um it's that it is just that what i would say that goldilock size which is just that perfect little size yeah over a little over half an inch yeah. and then i love the janelle adair detail all down these are super comfortable and the gallery back's beautiful mm, i love the really detailed ones like that because those are the janelle adair and the tree of life are always the most intricate uh, galleries that we do. So I always pick those a lot. Um, but again, it goes to my master silversmiths in Bali. Um, again, here's this, oh my gosh, I love this. Matter of fact, two pieces together, cool too. Um, but I'm going to have a bunch of gemstone, um, single gemstone rings too. And um, with that being said, it's gonna, I'll probably bring this one in later because it literally can snug right into um, another ring and just looks so good as Ooh, you gotta a, show that like, that looks really you know good. so like this kind of thing here to where you can like move it into like a bigger ring see how it just kind of hug, hugs that like that love that that's nice and this one of course goes with perfect with the bangle and the earrings <laughs> it does um everything's gonna kind of coordinate i'm a little matchy matchy but you ladies really got me out of my design comfort. It used to have to be matching collections exactly. 
So I really have kind of challenged myself to do other things to where they coordinate, but they're not exact on some things. But yes, I for you ladies that really um, were like me, that really, I love to buy at least minimum of two pieces. Um, I always say my gemstones are so different and usual when you go to try to get something to match back to it. Sometimes it's harder to find something. So I always say at least two pieces, but my grandma always bought in full collections and you know, I'm still a little bit like that, even though you ladies have taught me that I don't always have to wear them all together. <laughs> Sharon would like to know if the hoops are lightweight, those little hoops. Yeah, I'm wondering mm -hmm. if somebody has the access to actually even say the ground weight on those. They feel light to me. I know I have sensitive ears too, and these I would pick up and I would, I would put them in. Yeah, for me, you know, my ears are a little bit softer like that, so... I would say for me, um, again, sometimes my ears are a little bit, um, I can't feel them because they're <laughs> older. Um, but yeah, for me, actually, as I was moving around, I probably forgot I was wearing, wearing them. So, it. Yeah. Yeah. I would say, yeah, without it being a dangle on um, the weight of it. But here's the thing you get it home, and if you feel like the weight's ever too much, please, no, like send them back. They're mm -hmm. 9.7 grams total for both. Both earrings. Okay, so less than um, five grams per mm -hmm. per side. Yeah, and that includes the earring back. So, yep, you should be good to go then. All right, should we show a sneak peek of the next one? Oh, yeah, the earring back's a loner, almost two grams. So, yeah, no, those should be really, really nice for you. Yes, so um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to try a few things on so you can kind of get an idea. Um, you kind of saw me do this kind of look a little bit. Um, and then you saw also kind of how I took the, the two stone and I, I'm loving the multi bracelets with my tip to tips. Um, also, I have bracelet of the week on. So, of course, my torsage twist, um, that is also like chain link looks good with everything. It looks good. Mm -hmm. And if you, yeah. if you come in, I'll be able oh, to Oh, see yeah, yeah. There you so go. actually, you're also seeing with the camera that I can actually yes, kind of come in can. a little bit like that. We're Oops. learning. Today. Okay. So They're right there. There. Oh, that's right this way. Okay. I'm going to be hitting those ca uh, ca uh, camera angles, right? But yeah, just to kind of give you an idea, like I love this also too, because you can see that it, any kind of stone like that, it kind of acts like the ring too, how it kind of just, you know, hugged into each other a little bit. And again, you also saw, we're going to be showing this later. Um, but I just love the little middies I, and the little pinky rings even too that you can wear with it. Um, but I will do a little bit. Oh, is that one thing too? Um, that will give you an idea of like the earring um, and how they kind of, the, the size and the scale um, of those hoops also that you're asking about. Um, but what I thought I would pop on too is the barrel necklace. So um, you can see I added that coral because to me, you know, I really kind of like that look. Um, with that, and um, it's so funny. Yeah. Oh, I good. thought you were going to tell me something. No, I'm so sorry. <laughs> okay. Yeah. But oh they my gosh, a great look. I, your nails. You look beautiful. Thanks, ladies. You're awesome. Look okay. The lock at the the lock. Did you see? I didn't have to unthread the chain, which <laughs> I just love that idea. But yeah, black is easy breezy, right? Like you can't go wrong with that. Um, I think the other thing that I think I will put on too just so you can get a better look, is I want to kind of show you like in scale um, what the barrel looks like, because to me, they're just, they're, it's just so elegant and so perfect, right? I love so, those earrings. And I think I'll flip out the pendants. So, you know, sometimes I'll go a little bit more demure like this, because sometimes I do four bracelets per, per side, you know? So sometimes I'll be doing that. So sometimes the neck and the ear, I'll kind of downsize a little bit because I tend to do more on my fingers, right? And um, again, my favorite thing would be to do too is um, love that look. Look at, we're, we're doing the heartbeat midi ring along with the zigzag ring. So how pretty would that be? But you saw earlier too how I took that, um, this ring right here and literally put that, the zigzag on with it. So I'm going to reverse it so you can kind of see what that looks like too. Isn't that neat looking? So you ladies that love to stack your bracelets, now you've got some rings that you can do that with too. And they're, they're requesting zigzag hoops. Joan 
Joan would love some zigzag oh. boots to match. You know what? I did, actually, I did do some at the beginning. They did not lay right. They did not look good. So, but it was just trying to get that right angle. Um, but I did originally design some, but I'd have to totally go back to the, the drawing board. But yes, any kind of fun shape, eventually I feel like I'm going to hit every shape. So um, I'll, I'll get back to those and see what I come up with. Ray says, sure. you always look so stylish. Oh, <laughs> thank you, my friend. Oh my gosh, Ray. You ladies styling my jewelry. I've seen that you guys are the style masters out there. Okay. All right. We... I got to do both. And so, yeah, should we move on to the next tray? So, red, red. rubies, coral. I mean, kind of cool because we're coming up upon uh, 4th of July. So, why not, right? So, so what we're going to do is always show you a little tray like this. A little sneak peek. And then what we're going to do is kind of a little sneak peek of what's about to come. And then we're going to go in and we're going to show you some of the things. So, you know what I think I might do? I'll kind of look at the trade that you're doing too, Tanya, mm -hmm. because I think maybe what we'll do is show a little bit, then maybe I can stop and stylize maybe a little bit of it. Okay. Um, because there is a lot on this trade. There is a lot to show. Um, and there's, I think there's going to be a lot of really cool looks, but um, this is going to be that Ruby. Um, mm. That is it's, I would say more red, you know, I do another uh, Ruby, but this is the African Ruby. And um, it's just really a gorgeous, like, shade of red. Um, and it's got that really beautiful, like, um, dreamy kind of effect to it. I love so, that. Look yeah. at the color play. That's so pretty. It looks really pretty. A lot of comments today, mm -hmm. too, about how much sharper the image is. Really? Really? You can see the jewelry oh, really good. clearly. And really? Yeah. They're like in the... the Jewelry. So it's the, is that, do we say that's Shopify that helped us? <laughs> Must be. Because <laughs> we didn't get a new iPad. <laughs> <laughs> and then the So yeah, it must opal. be the platform. Um, and awesome. anyway, this is Australian opal. And this is like, I'm going to bring some white Australian opal in. But any opal coming out of Australia right now is just precious. It is so rare and so hard to come by now. So anyway, I am lucky that I still have a source. But ladies, I kind of told you how the price of this ruby, this uh, opal, how expensive it is, except for the person I have is going direct. Then they're making um, and cutting those stones and then I get first access to it. Um, but it should be three times what wow. what we have the opals listed for. Um, so kind of a big deal. You know, Ethian Opian Opal is much more affordable, much more uh, abundant, and um, it's not something that's, like, really sourced out. Um, the Australian Opal, very close to sourcing out, totally. Um, the miners are just not finding that kind of material. Really? And, I mean, if you've ever been to Australia, you're going to be super partial to Australian Opal because Australia is just absolutely gorgeous. And the minerals and the specimens and the gems that come out of Australia, we're going to be showing a lot of like peanut wood and the, the rhyolite and a lot of really cool um, opaque materials this year. Well, I love these earrings and I'm definitely going to have to put these earrings on. Um, so I actually, that's perfect. So I think I'm going to start getting the opals ready. I mean, the ruby. The ruby. I keep getting the, so pretty. the ruby. Isn't that funny? Because I'm usually the one showing it. So I know, now it might I'm be getting little... my words mixed up. Because <laughs> <laughs> I'm looking at my tray, but you're showing the jewelry. So. And you can like, see that sparkle in the ruby and the chain link. This is a good set of earrings. It is. It is. It, like, it, it, to me, this is that one that, ladies, I probably, um, hopefully, you'll see a bunch of other gems from me in these because. Um, yeah, they're really, it, it's, it's just kind of one of those looks that you're going to get it on and kind of go, wow, this might be my favorite earring of the, mm -hmm. the month. It'll go with a lot of different things. And then we have the bracelet too. Mm -hmm. And this is going to be with the chain link. So, um, our bracelet of the week is going to go back to that like so perfectly. So of course I'm going to keep my bracelet of the week on and, um, love that because we have so, ooh, wow, that looks really good with this. Okay. Love it. Um, and this one, um, again, this is, I've got it in the Sleeping Beauty Turquoise and I also have it in the Ruby because to me, I love the edgy of that. So at one point we used leather. Now we use faux leather because there were a lot of ladies that wanted it, but they said they don't really use leather. So um, 
really, to be honest, the faux leather actually costs more than the leather. So it's kind of uh, silly. But um, anyway, I hope you enjoy the aspect of it. We literally bezel set it in just like we do our stones. Uh, but to me, it's just really edgy and cool because, you know, I'm a hand talker. So I love anything that has detail, like all, you know, from front to back. Uh, today, it was so funny. They overscheduled me. So I ended up having to wait. Um, and it was, it was so funny. Ladies, do you get lost in your gemstones and your jewelry sometimes, <laughs> the detail? So I thought, oh my gosh, I wonder if I'm, ladies have moments like these too, where it's like, you know, you just kind of go, wow, you know, I really mm -hmm. love this piece. So at the stone and all the mm -hmm. detail. Yes, that's and right. And ring is available in a size 11 or 12. Oh, okay. So we're super limited on that, but we still want to give a little bit of a tour. Um, I'm finding that we are running out of rings way faster than anything else. So um, I am trying to, as opposed to our bracelets, because I'm trying to hit so many sizes, um, you might see some other things pop up. Maybe we've already sold out of all the ruby, but maybe there'll be another ring that, that might uh, sneak in here or there. Ooh, this one goes back to the bracelet. And, you you know, probably not as many pendants. I tend to design, like, definitely more, um, you know, I might do two bracelets to a collection, two rings to a collection. But I usually only bring in about one pendant and one earring. Um, and anyway, I did the really great bar hinging, so you're going to have movement. Um, I know we're busy women, and sometimes, like, that pendant can be stiff and awkward. I want it to really conform and move to your body, just like my other jewelry pieces I designed for you. All right, and we got the earrings. Those okay. are so cute. So we're going to opal it up. Um, so I'm going to start with the ruby earrings, of course. Um, but remember, these little um, gems, you're going to get that rainbow of color in the opal. So, you know, I kind of love these opals in that sense. It's they're going to match back with so many different things. So if you have a collection and you don't have earrings to it, think about the different colors that will be in here, the greens and the blues and the reds and the pink. So Really, you're getting that rainbow of, of color in real Australian opal. So pretty. And we are down to just three pair left um, on the earrings. So oh, okay. They're, they're low quantity. We did have a question yes. from Becky Waker. Mm -hmm. And how does the faux uh, work with the water? Oh, Is just like leather. It gets kind of wet, like, but it doesn't ruin it, right? So um, sometimes, well, because my I've never taken care of my leather purses, it tends to... I guess softer. <laughs> so no, I would not worry about the water situation at all. Now, would I go swimming in that? Probably not. No, I'd probably take my jewelry like off if you were going swimming. But yeah. if you're just washing your hands and it's splashing on there, you're good to go. I'm never that really careful. And I think about that. So I'm already like 10 steps or two years ahead on designs like that because I really think about how you're wearing the jewelry, not just putting out a pretty piece, but yeah, I know that you're going to uh, work this jewelry and you're not going to change your lifestyle just because you're wearing a piece of jewelry. Um, so I want it to work for a busy lifestyle. Limited quantities on the ring as well. Size 11 or 12 is available. Mm. Okay, yeah. So we're like... <laughs> All right, let's try There is going to be some things. So to the, it, ladies, um, we are kind of getting down on some of those, but I still like to show them, you know, because... Sometimes you ladies are finishing pieces. The only way they go back to, to, you know, like on sale is when we do a show. So I do like, even if it's lower quantity. Now you might see a few things that are um, what we call page only. So you'll see on the website, we won't be showing them on the show. So um, after you might want to go to our website and do we still have this? Friday live page, yep. And you'll see all of the jewelry that Michelle showed on Wednesday, as well as all the jewelry we featured here tonight. That's right. And there might be a few things in there where we only have a couple sizes or something yeah. like that left. And what I did is when we did the Wednesday, I had mm -hmm. that at the top. And now for today's jewelry, it starts at the top. Okay. So the Wednesday shift scale. Yeah. On the page. And, you know, as we get kind of going with this and stuff too, because it is live shopping like that, um, we, you know, we'll kind of pivot and move and kind of change things. So you might see less and less if there's lower quantity that we wouldn't show during the show so we can hang out with you more. Um, I want to give a big shout out to Janie. Oh my gosh, I see you, Crystal. Um, Miss Rosa, and oh my gosh, Patty, how are you doing? I'm so great to see you. Connie, oh my gosh, and look at look at Ola. Okay, I have to say, and comments are 
on the jury or Janelle. I did miss beginning. Oh, <laughs> she missed something. So go over it again. I think she was saying. So, so I, I think the question is, uh, what what is the comment at the top of the Facebook feed? And so what that is mm. is if you comment that number. So if you say sold. An example would be sold 100. That would then send you a direct message of the Embrace Grace Pendant in Diamond to your uh, Facebook Messenger. And that link, you could then just click that link to follow to the product page at Sarda.com. So that overlay is just to tell you what item we are currently showing at the moment. Well, and you know what I'm realizing too is that I'd love to be doing this more like here where um, I'm seeing Tanya and I'm seeing Lisa Crandall is out there too. And Shirley, hello. Oh my gosh, Sarah. Oh my gosh, I listen. I, oh, ladies, like hugs, hugs, kisses, kisses. Gina, so great to see you tonight too. Amy Long. Now, Amy, I guess I think Amy's getting together with uh, Amberly, I think. And Miss April, how are you doing? I, I interviewed in April, but she is not the original April person. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yes, so um, love my hoops because there's a retention closure on those. Um, so there's the retention closure with, of course, that's going to snap back. And I love having that feature. And then you're going to get the Janelle Adair. Um, and again, these are those, you know, hoops that you're going to get so much use out of um, and so much wear. Um, you would find kind of hoops like this. Like, you know, I always say pieces like this. We were, and this is what, two, over two decades ago, about 25 years ago, we were always 300. So I don't even know what that means to in today's world. Would that mean 450 now? Like, I don't know. So yeah, things like that. It's those upgraded features. And you're going to see always with my pricing now, I do not do the upgraded features in charge. <laughs> like, I just want you to have like the best of the best kind of pieces. Now, ladies, who does... I, I, okay, so actually, if you type in sold 126, guess what? The link to this bracelet is going to be sent to you. All you have to do is click on it and it takes you right to be able to purchase it. Yeah. So this is going to be really helpful for sometimes those things that um, go quickly, right? So we know that this feature and the way that we're going to be doing the show, we sell out of things kind of pretty quickly on, on a realm. So always know if you want that link fast and you want to get it before anybody else, you just like this is the held up in grace bracelet. Um, the tip to tip. Um, but I'm going to tell you, go to our website and make sure you heart that for later, because this is going to be one of those bracelets that will make you fall in love with my bracelets again mm -hmm. and make you realize like, Janelle, she's got my wrist down. Um, I want so comfortable those. and in the work. They, if, first of all, I, oh, look at it with the zigzag. Oh my gosh. Perfect. Yeah, Perfect. A lot of sizes, seven size options on this. Wow. So, yeah. Like, someone has a five and a quarter inch wrist. Or maybe you have an eight inch wrist. It's, it's seven it's different gonna, sizes. Yes. So remember, you're going to fit two sizes. Now, this is kind of like the love one another style that I take all the time. Um, it fits beautifully fitted, or you can do it kind of loose. Mm -hmm. So um, again, there there's probably one small overlap, or you could even be into three. So you get to pick. Yeah. Okay. So um, what kind of sizing you want. Um, but as you're doing that stack, you know, like I said, I have three different bracelet sizes in a bangle. Now, chain, all the other bracelet styles are different, but I'm from a six and a quarter, six and a half, six, seven, five. Those are like my favorite sweet spots and my sevens. So mm -hmm. I have a whole rack. Usually when I do sevens because they're looser, I do all my sevens together. Yeah, that makes sense. And then this one is beautiful, the sponge coral. Just love this. And the patterning. I go back and forth with Quebec all the time. Like, I want the patterning. So if you bought a lot of sponge coral from people, sometimes it's just a red, right? And they'll say it's sponge. And you can see the little, really cool little design. But I want that really cool patterning. Um, not so easy to do because not all of it's patterned. But, you know, I want something that's really interesting and, you know, just kind of that both of those textures are just so pretty mm -hmm. together. Um, now, what I love about our curl too is you're going to get, it doesn't matter if you are a cool or a warm red, this, um, all the coral does actually work and fit into that. So, um, 
yeah, that is something that will work for you um, because you get the tomato reds, right? Um, that actually has some like the cool blues to it. So again, you're getting both of those reds within the sponge coral. So pretty. And there's a ring. And, you know, we do get the uh, coral from Bali too. So um, this has got the little fringe of any. This is one of my favorite little bezels too. Um, yeah. And all of those, even though those little beads are actually then each single one of them to really kind of bezel set that stone in, you're going to see the detail of that, that gorgeous detail in the leaf design and then the frangipanis. But I've done this in amethyst, at uh, the star amethyst also, um, but it's definitely one of those favorites. And the gallery is one of my favorites. Oh yeah. That's so cute. Like, isn't that sweet? Yeah. I love that. <laughs> yeah, Big nice. kiss. Big kiss. Big flower kiss. Yeah. The rings available in a size 8, 10, 11, or 12. Okay. Nice. So, yeah, you're going to see a little bit. So, sometimes I think that's really good because you can click on that link and you can kind of see the sizes available. So, you can click as many times as you want into the feed that says sold 128. It'll send you that link. It directs you right back uh, to our website where you'll see sizing and, and availability. Yeah. So, on um, what they see at the top mm -hmm. shows the sizes that... It, it was made in, but it may not necessarily be in stock in that size. That's what I wanted to let them know if they weren't. Because it'll say 5 through 12. On Shopify, you mean? Yes. Okay. They're going to see it's available 5 through 12. Mm -hmm. But maybe we only have an 8, 10, or 11. Yes. So just let yes, them yes, know. Yes, yes, um, yes. Um, we have in stock. Okay, well, I don't know. Did we go to the Believe Always bracelet? Mm -hmm. So um, now this one I love because it's going to fit a ton of people with that. Um, Three adjustable toggle link. Um, it is going to pretty much accommodate just about everybody. Um, but these, th this is what really my footprint in my designs is what I was known for. Multi gemstone bracelets like this with different pieces. They lay just really beautiful. Um, if you don't have a toggle, like a lot of people in the past would be like, I lost a toggle bracelet before. It's because they weren't engineered or designed properly. So. Um, you will love our toggle bracelets. Super easy to get on. Mm -hmm. um, and it, again, the fit of these bracelets are always uh, like really lovely. And so there's a few questions on how to scroll through the comments on both Facebook and the website. So if you actually kind of hold your uh, finger over the comments, you should be able to scroll down and up on both Facebook and the website. Okay, thank you so much, Sarah. So, um, yeah, this is kind of a new format, so we're really excited to get your kind of feedback. <gasps> Carol Klein, how are you? Oh, my gosh, it's so great to see you. Um, Miss Nancy Lee, oh, my gosh, my girlfriend, Teresa Rudergram. I did. I missed lunch. I was not feeling so good. I took a, um emergency, and I took a PV light on Wednesday. <laughs> um, Simona, welcome in. So nice to see you, too. Um, Junie, Junie Bug. Oh, that's so cute. Who's Junie Bug? I love that. That is cute. That is darling. Thanks Ms. for Miss Randy Hahn. Um, so great. Everybody's like telling, helping everybody out to uh, this new format. Yes. <laughs> so and best if, people ever. If people have suggestions, uh -huh. we would love them to write in to contact yeah. us. Yeah. Yeah. Contact us. Yeah. With yeah. Feedback. We, we, we how we can it. make it better. What mm -hmm. was good? What didn't work? And that's right. We're, working through this yeah <laughs> we have a lot of people here tonight to kind of see how it's going to go and even for me because i just realized as i was talking oh wait i can actually focus in on what tanya is uh showing there too again we love to give you a 360 because I, of course i'm going to design everything from front to back we already probably gave that a little measure and <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, to kind of give that scale of size on that too oops um, oh, I do that all the time. I know. Remember, <laughs> now you're on that side. Time is the one that's always helping me. Like, oh, you've got it on centimeters again, Janelle. You put it back to interest. So um, anyway, so let's move on to the next piece, which Ooh. I'm very excited to. Uh, I might have to just put that that little puppy on right away. This is so beautiful. Kirsten Michelle said that the red coral pieces look so vibrant. Oh, they're just really okay. popping on the screen. Oh my gosh. Well, that's what they are in real life. Mm -hmm. So that's really cool. So I think that's what I'm going to do because like to me, they're just some really showcase pieces that we won't be bringing back. So I'm definitely going to pop that red necklace on because I look at, I've got white sleeves. I've got a navy blue top and then red. So like, yep, love it. 
like for me, it's like the month, all the month of July. It's not just for 4th of July. It's like, yeah, right. And the back is just as beautiful. Love it. Oh my gosh. So um, they're going to have the little Janelle Adair, um, but not easy to get all those clasps and everything actually lined up, just so you know. So um, definitely challenging to make sure that we, um, you know, get all of those coral pieces that would match um, up nicely like that. So it looks good. And we did a show special on the necklace tonight, Janelle. Okay. What'd you do? Two forty nine. Oh my gosh, you know how I'd love to get some of those necklaces out. So thank you. And Michelle. they can still use the thirty dollars off the one seventy five. So it actually brings it down to two nineteen. Oh wow. Wow. All right. And then I gotta do a little show of the bracelet too, because that is stunning. You can see the red coral. So the um yeah, so matching up all these beautiful stones like that and it again you know, um, the sponge coral is a little bit harder for us to source now than the other, like the, the coral that kind of has the white oh, really? through it. Um, well, and also here's the thing. Could we get some, but I, the amount that I won't use because I want the really good patterning, there'd be a lot, but I mean, if you even saw the rejection pile for the stones after we've cut them, um, again, you know, I am using really generous gram weights and silver, you know, it's handcrafted, I mean, six, eight months sometimes to get some of these pieces to you finally. So I want to make sure the gemstones really are going to match that, like, you know, quality um, in line with all your other pieces, right? I, I need it to be that that same really beautiful quality. So, Jean, so Jean said she wore um, the red coral pieces on a business trip and got a ton of compliments. Oh, oh my gosh. Okay. Ooh, I'd love to see that outfit. I bet you she's like walking in. Red is that statement. It's that power color, right? You just kind of, you know, I mm -hmm. I love putting the red corals with all my like black spinels. And um, I love mixing actually the black coral, Indonesian coral with oh, yeah. the sponge coral. To me, it's a very high mm -hmm. elevated look, mm -hmm. you know. And Carlotta was asking yeah. about seeing the necklace on and we will definitely do that. Oh. Um, we're going to tour a few pieces and then we will come to a yeah. shop wearing the necklace yeah so, so there's I think this out we're, we're like grouping stock grouping stock so this is our first show so this will be really fun to kind of put things together but michelle you know me i'm just going to tell you how i'm going to do it next time okay but like we can probably do one look and then we'll kind of like show it on because i think it is it's showing and seeing the pieces up close and touring now that to me is is wonderful but it's always nice to actually see it on a person so you can actually get that scale right um now we are going to be trying to do more model shots and things like that but mm -hmm. right now we we don't have the capacity this stuff sells too quickly for us to put uh the time into yeah, it Yeah, it really goes really quick yeah <laughs> but on reorder we're going to try we're going to yep. try to pre-plan ahead of time to get more photos and things like that but you know me i love doing new 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 all the time but we do have to get some pieces in on pre-order because it's much, it's really hard for my uh, team in Bali and my family to continue to make new. They're like, Janelle, so much new. <laughs> um, but I told them, I said, I kind of want to do like one full year, of, like a lot of new. And then, you know, I know ladies, sometimes you look at that and go, I love that bracelet. However, I, you know, I, maybe I don't wear red. I'd love to see it in another color. So you're also seeing me this year really, um, I, I got such amazing feedback that you'd want to see things in other colors. Okay, these all little silver rings like that, to me, are a must. Like, mm -hmm. super important to have those really great little basics um, in that, too. So, um, yes. Wait, oh, okay, right minutes. now it says Joyful Pendant. Where, what's going on here? Where are we? Huh? I, I, I'm looking for it. Oh, okay. Maybe I went out. I probably went out of order. Oh, okay. Yep. So we'll and see we're learning. So we're probably learning. We, yep, we'll have some help and some um, things with that. But yeah, it's a I lot. Love the Time is, now you you now know, I get like, this you side. got my top. Like <laughs> which is always very, I wanted to spend more time and now I'm seeing I'm like now 
Yeah, yeah. It's yeah. like it's a lot, right? Talking and showing, and I know. Okay, question for you, Janelle from uh-huh. Rosa. Uh-huh. If you could only buy two pieces of a collection, which two necklace, bracelet, ring, earrings would you recommend? Okay, so what from what I've shown so far? Um, now pieces like this, like when you see a necklace that Michelle put the, you know, when we do the necklace and bracelet at a cost like that, you just do it because these, these are supposed to be a lot more like my necklaces like this. I already lower the MSRP. It's not supposed to be that it's supposed to be a lot higher. So, um, what I would say is. I'd be going for the the show special. So when you see that there's an additional markdown, those would be the ones I'd say go for, because um, we've really lined up that that special price for those. So yes, yeah, that looks good. Okay. Well, and also yes. too, I guess with that, like going back a little bit, um, just kind of giving you that idea, like of that scale of that size. Oh, so I think actually my tape needs to go. Over even more. I have a middle right spot, but I think that's not my middle spot. I think it's right here. Maybe when we go live, it moves over. I'm moving my piece of tape because it's like Janelle, stand right here. Yeah. So Victoria would like to know if you plan on doing making any earrings for Obsidian Snowflake. She has a pendant and a ring, and would like some earrings. Okay, I gotta work on it because the Snowflake Obsidian to get the pattern. It really takes a bigger stone. So you know how I designed some of those other ones? They were, um, the, the really the weight of them was heavier than I know I'd be comfortable sending out to you ladies. So, um, I'm thinking an option might be um, the eagle's eye. If I've got some of the gemstones to go with that, I think the eagle's eye would be really pretty. And I did some earrings in those. But the snowflake, they'd be quite large and probably too heavy. Um, so originally, sometimes I do design those, but then I find uh, that it's not going to be really comfortable. <laughs> so then I don't um, yeah, move forward with pyrite them. coming in the next couple months that I think would be really nice as well. Oh, the pyrite? Yeah, this is the pyrite. Oh, the silver. Oh, that kind of comes in the black. I hope so. Because it's kind of like silver Well, black. we've not seen it yet. <laughs> So I have ordered it and it does say silver, but it has the gold in it. Yeah. Then I'm scrapping it and I'm starting over. There's four different pyrites. So I'm waiting right now to see which one's because I was like, it says silver. It could be silver, but he was saying, I'm not sure which one's which. <laughs> so yeah, that's the one I'm going for though. Yeah. I want the silver pyrite because I love that gold pyrite. We have a collection with that, but mm. silver. Mm. yeah, that would look really good. So pretty. Can we do a spin first? A spin? Okay, yes. we're doing a spin for, for um, everyone who's left a review this month. Okay. We appreciate reviews so much, okay. and I think we're going to give away one of the bracelets of the week. Is that right? Okay. All right. So this one's right. done. That one is yep. done. Okay. If we can get the, mm-hmm. I'm going to show the spinner. Mm-hmm. So I think with this, yes. there we go. All right. There we go. Okay. Still a more low tech, but uh, still, I'm sure the person wins a lot of fun. Oh my gosh. Okay. Wow. Mm-hmm. Well, tonight I hope the names will be bigger because we're going to be doing this at the end of the night. So remember, a- Adrian Sherman. Oh my gosh, Adrian Sherman. Yeah. I wonder if I wonder if we're related. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Was right. that the one? Yeah. Okay, so one. all of you. Thank you for leaving reviews, guys. Right. No, thank you. And remember, all your comments, hello, Christy. Uh, Lisa Crangel, I will try. She said, exclamation. exclamation. So Jean Scheller, hello. Linda Gresham, hello, my sister in Christ. I'm so good to see you. All you ladies at the end of the tonight are going to be entered in. Um, oh, Dorsella, hello. Oh, my gosh, I saw your post, too. It's so cute. Um, anyway, so yes, we love that. So now is it one per, co- uh, per, per one comment, per one, um, month? And then for every, co- there for the reviews. Oh, I'm, I'm actually talking about tonight's drawing. Oh, tonight's drawing. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. So the next one we're doing, everyone who leaves. Cause we only, yeah, we just did that one, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. The next one's where we get the cards. So I'm going to start pulling those names and then at the end of the show, We'll have another drawing. For You're three just cards. starting to pull the names. You better yeah. Yeah. like I'm like you better I'm, get going. Because yeah. there's a lot of ladies making posts in there. 
Okay. So we had a question. What size <laughs> bracelet you were to have in the zigzag? In the zigzag. I ended up going with the 675. Yeah. So um, for me, I prefer the 675 on this one. Okay. Um, because the way that it torsages up. Um, now, this is a good example where the six and a half would actually have fit me. But I prefer the 675. Like, see how like perfect that is? Stacked so with it. And that's the bracelet of the week, but what about mm -hmm. the zigzag? Did you know the Derek? Oh, the zigzag. Okay, okay you the have a seven zigzag. On that one. Um, I believe you have a seven. Yeah, yeah. I, I did a little bit bigger for the mm -hmm. stacking on that one. You are correct because you pulled them for me. You. So you're asking me the size, and I'm like, wait a minute, you helped me, did you? Did. She dressed me. <laughs> <laughs> yes, okay. So um, we are going to go into the next ray, but you got to see a little bit of that coral. Oh my gosh, can I just say one thing, ladies? Uh, back to, now please tell me, do you do you mm. see how gorgeous that is with the red coral? Like, I think that's still got to be one of my favorite looks. And just so you know, the Chrysocolis Sonora, just so you know, we've got more coming. These mm. bracelets in a marquee, oh, to die for. They're absolutely gorgeous. All right, so you got a sneak peek of the tray. <laughs> okay. We're going to start with... Moisey, Moisey, Moisey. So um, Moisey. we love Moisey and I. And do you see tonight, Michelle gave me two of the Twisted Cable um, bracelets. I am literally going to use both of those tonight. Um, to me, like that tip to tip, um, that's another look that I think is so pretty on. Ooh, the Moisey night just sparkles under the light. So I, pretty. Well, and you know what, ladies? I, you know, I love this because, you know, I did the all silver, the ring just like this in the Tree of Life, which is so pretty. Um, but this has the watermark with the um, high polish torsage twist. Um, but yeah, this is a big eight millimeter on this one. So this is an eight millimeter stone. And um, what is the dimensions? What's the carat weight on that, ladies? For an eight millimeter, 1.7. Okay. Yes. Okay. Like you can break. I got. Yes, it's one over one and a half carats. <laughs> and then we have this next moissanite ring. So cute. Okay, that's made for more rings. And that has a six millimeter stone for a total carat weight of 0.68 carats. So you ladies, there was a song that was made for more. That's where I got that one from. Like. I, I love that. It's like, you know, it's like, oh, what am I doing? It's like, nope, he's got it, and he's made me to do more. And, and I, love I love that. That. <laughs> that gives me encouragement, you know? Um, now, this is my love one another. Um, ladies, if you don't have my all silver love one another, um, which we also have, um, really, I, I'm always going to send you there every day. It is one of the, like, best low profile like bracelets that I do. Um, so I had to design you a Moise Night one because to me, the best look is actually taking your love one another, wearing it as a tip to tip, and then wearing it with this Moise Night one. And so um, mm -hmm. you're gonna see that in the feed coming up. Um, but it is, yeah, it is just one of those bracelets. Oops, it is sorry. butter. Um, the dimensions, the width and everything on it, it is not, um, it, it's meant to just be so, so comfortable. Oh, do you have your own bracelet on? Yeah, oh. I have one of my new beginnings oh, okay. real quick. Here we go, let's take that off. And this is available in eight sizes. Okay. Which uh, is seven lots. millimeters stone mm -hmm. in moist night. So 0.98, so almost a full carat. Okay, and do you see what Tanya, this is why, like if you have the smartwatch or anything, she is wearing it fitted. Mm -hmm. So again, Tanya could actually get into three different sizes. Um, but I wanted to show you that this one is really comfortable fitted. Mm -hmm. Do you see how that just kind of snugs in and contours to your wrist? So again, you might have three different sizes. I really wanted to give you the option because fitted, this is probably one of my number one like designs that I've done for you. Um, and we do. I mean, there are some times that I want a really fitted bracelet. Um, I'm a bangle girl. I like to, you know, I, I tend to wear mine a little looser, but... Again, ladies, play with that. I give you that kind of pricing that makes these affordable where you can kind of test and play with different sizes and where you don't always have to get the same size. Um, it's, I think, really good for stacking too. So when you're getting ready in the morning and you're starting to play with stacking your bracelets, 
You know, Mm -hmm. there's always that perfect one where you're like, there's my perfect stack because it just fits the best. But you might have three different size bracelets on when, you know, you create your stack. And this has bracelet has the two five millimeter moissanite stones for a total carat weight of 0.72. Okay. And, um, oh my gosh, look, oh, they just dance. They did moissanite just dances. And you know what I love? Like diamonds get that really beautiful white light. You know, sometimes that warm light, sometimes that comes through. But this one is just the light that comes through. It's this rainbow spectrum of colors. And that's why moissanite is just so big. Mm-hmm. You know, uh, we're going to be doing a stone this, um, you know, bringing in some other white gemstones. And it's literally a white light where a diamond can add white, but kind of a warmth to it. Moissanite gives you these beautiful colors and sparkles um really like that flawless diamond look you know so that's why moissanite people think a lot of times you're wearing a diamond ring Mm -hmm. you know it would just be the top top great it'd be like yeah and then we also have tanzanite which is also so pretty yeah this is one of those uh necklaces um that i brought in because Ladies, did you see the roses going on? You just all received your roses from God. So necklace. So I wanted to kind of sneak in a little Tanzanite necklace um, for you to enjoy to wear with your roses from God. So um, if you got like a, you know, one of the longer 18 uh, or like 20 inch necklaces, this one, you could wear shorter and create really a really beautiful layer yeah. look. Beautiful. Matter of fact, next week, you ladies got all your roses, but you're going to have another opportunity to get the roses from God necklace. So we had some people asking about it. Yes. So ladies, you might have to watch Fourth of July is coming up here. So we're going to, you know, be doing some really fun things. But yeah, of course I had to do some extra ones because we cut that sale off. And so many of you ladies were hitting the notify me, notify me, you know, and please, please bring in extras. Okay, so this is one of the gemstones that, again, we're having troubles. Uh, They're so, so hard to set. So we're kind of coming to the end of our ammonites. Uh, This is actually an ammonite. Um, So it's a fossil, and it's like old. And we've taken abalone, real abalone, and we've inlaid each one of those little sections on wearable art. Um, Next level. Like some of the stuff that's out there, you're seeing a little bit of this in the market. I can tell you it's not going to be close to our quality, but it takes a lot of skill to be setting these gemstones. So the mother of pearl with the um, amylite, um, we're going to be discontinuing that. And also, of course, the amylite with the abalone inlay is in that quarter category where we're not going to be able to do reorders on these either. So we're kind of giving you that last chance opportunity. Um, it probably will show up in one more show, and then that's it. And we have three. We're down, we did have five. We're down to three sizes. So we still have three sizes. On okay. This. Well, there's still, yeah. yeah. And um, with those, you know, really that size range, you're probably going to find with the three that we have left, one still probably going to fit. I was you. just looking, mm-hmm. and it actually does cross over. So yeah. I think it it's, still yeah, range it's still going to from a six to an eight. Yeah, we yeah. should even have something. And um, I love this style. Like this is my go-to style. It like there's really nothing out there like this. And you know, I wanted to do something that wasn't too out there, but just something that seemed to look good on every mm-hmm. size wrist. And as I was making the different sizes on this, everybody. Um, at my company, I was like, oh my gosh, that looks so good on you. Oh my gosh, that looks so good mm-hmm. on you. So that's why this was the one that I decided to do in different gemstones and lots of, you know, the three sizes to try to hit just about everybody. Um, this one, the magnet enhancer is like into the actual bail on this. Um, so I love that. I mean, and that's why too, you saw me put this on the collar earlier and I'll slide the collar on because, um, with this as we go off, but um, to me, like I absolutely love my collar. Also, with the moissanite, I wanted to put this whole look on um, with the moissanite too because the moissanite piece is really beautiful. Mm-hmm. And Michelle, how many? Uh, actually, we have we didn't show that yet. Do you know what? Uh, Not yet. And the the collar, yeah. So let's make sure we let people know the sizes when that pops up too. The uh, ammonite pendant that Tony was just hearing. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, last call. There are only two left. <gasps> So I'm going to make sure we, the people knew there were only two left in that. Mm-hmm. And then the matching ring, we have size 7, 8, or 12. Okay. So pretty. 
Now, um, I'm kind of excited because we're starting to get some of these other um, pieces and combinations. So when we come to this, I'm totally going to speak on these. I yes. love that. Um, okay. So again, this is going to be that really, that showcase piece. Last time we're going to be um, making it. Um, but I, ju I just love this bracelet. Um, the, the color too. Like to me, this is not like seasonal. It's not like this would be like a year round mm -hmm. because of all the colors um, for the abalone. Um, but then again, I can see like the summer wearing some gladiators, like, you know, with mm -hmm. your favorite little skirt. Um, yeah. You know, capri dress, like this is your outfit with like, you know, really great, you know, pendant. Yeah. Maybe even an all silver pendant because you're the, the, the focus is purely on just this amazing cuff. Yeah. You know? That's such a beautiful cuff. Outfit around the bracelet. <laughs> I can see that. Okay, so, um, you know, I always love doing beaded jewelry. And to me, this was one of the prettiest ones. I love, Michelle actually grabbed this and threw it in. Um, this is literally um, the same color of the abalone. I'm going to give that back to Tanya because, um, now remember with this, isn't that gorgeous, the I little peekaboos that. of that? Yeah. Um, you can wear this lobster, this toggle, all the way to the back. Or you can actually hook it. Um, the pendant onto that and wear it in the front. Um, that's kind of the style right now. They're wearing all the like toggles and the lobsters in the front of it. And this is BDS 526 is an 18 inch necklace with a one inch extender. Okay. So cute. Well, and they only have to put sold 146 in, right? Or that. If you're on Facebook. It, oh, it's what? If you're on Facebook. You if you're on Facebook. If you're on our site, you can just click add a card, right? It's, you don't have to comment anything. Oh, okay. So yeah. actually they can go straight to our website. Yep. So ladies, probably the easiest way to do this is go watch the show from our website now. So mm -hmm. go to started.com probably would be really the best way to do it. Right, Joey? Yep. And then you just click on the item at the top of your screen and that will allow you to add it to your cart. I love that. Mm -hmm. Now, so what if they're like, um, we're not on, can they scroll back and kind of like find it or no, they have to hit it as they're, they're coming up. Um, so once you Click the product, I think it does show me. Yeah, so if you click a product, it'll show in this video, and then you can scroll through what we've shown already. Oh my gosh. Okay, yes. so that's kind of cool. And so that's on the website, not on Facebook. Okay, so of course we're streaming on Facebook, but yes, you go to um, our website, and it kind of sounds like it's a no brainer, easy, easy. That's pretty easy. Which, I, you know what, sometimes like Friday, we might need that help. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Like, sometimes I'm like, what day is it? What I know. Day is it? This By the end week? of the week. <laughs> right? I kept asking. I'm like, well, wait, what do you want me to do? What day is it today? <laughs> <laughs> so this collar is beautiful. Mm. And yeah. It's a show special. Ooh. It is. Oh, did you? I oh, did my gosh. $99. Wow. Oh, my gosh. Okay, we have not done that for a long time because um, as you see the sizes and stuff on this, it's kind of hard to get on that price point, ladies. But um, I love doing that for you, though. Look at this. I'm doing a whole wrist of moissanite. And then I'm doing the, the this because I wanted to kind of show you tonight, ladies, that you can do moissanite. And then you can do some of these other really cool, like, rings in it. And it works, right? Yeah. I love that look. So I just wanted to show real quick, we have the magnet extenders. So this will enhance your necklace. This one's a one inch. Um, this is, I well, believe the total goes to, um, yep. in, in the length of it. So you hook, um, on both sides, this just makes it super easy. So when you saw me like putting on necklaces, I'll put that, I'll take the collar off and I'll put the tanzanite one on. I've attached a magnet to it and it's that fast. Uh, but remember ours are rare earth magnets. So if you've bought magnets before, you know, off different websites and they've, um, not held your jewelry, um, you kind of have to get ours because they're like, we use a lot of silvers. So you want, um, to use our magnets because I, I do use the strongest magnet in the world. And most of them, they're using really kind of cheap magnets that actually wear out. Mm -hmm. So after they lose their magnetism, which our magnets don't. Yeah. They're Did very I make strong. That, that word is that? Magnetism. Magnetism. Magnetize. 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 Okay. Yeah. All I, right. I was kind of feeling like that was flu. It was too fluid. Yeah. Like it might not be a real word. Sarah's a, <laughs> Sarah's a new word queen. <laughs> I know. Oh my gosh. 
Okay, so okay, so this is the set, and we've not done the single ring yet. Mm -hmm. This one, oh my gosh, yeah, I love this ring. Okay, I'm bringing in a bunch of two ring sets for you, ladies. Okay, and um, I brought in um, this should have been a set, but I'm you ladies were saying, you know, I could afford it if you do two or if you just do one. So I'm trying to mix it up for you, but you need these rings because they're literally they, it looks like a euro shank. So um, when you start to stack your rings. Um, you get two of these, you are going to have so much fun. You're going to like watermark out some of your other pieces. But tonight, the next ring that we're going to show up, and if you're on our website, you're going to see them kind of next to each other. Um, I did my really beautiful scalloped watermark with this. Oh, I love this. Okay, I'm taking this tonight. I was waiting. <laughs> this is nice. It's so, see, I'm always looking for a ring to kind of counter like balance my other fingers. Oh yeah, let's show So that. I want to show you, like I always, look how delicate and beautiful that is, right? Um, next to the Moissanite. But look at, Michelle knew that I was going to love this because I love the love one another. I wear that one a little bit more fitted, um, but I also have a bangle style, but isn't that great? Oh, I like both of them. Isn't that pretty? Mm -hmm. Love it, Michelle. <gasps> great style, I see. <laughs> now we just got to get it on her, but she's not a bracelet. I mean, she's not a jewelry person. Yeah. Not, you, know what? Not 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 you don't have to be. We're my best <laughs> friends. You don't have to love the jewelry. You've been around the jewelry. it. Oh, no, you do love the jewelry. I you do. just don't wear jewelry. Yeah. Unless it's and, and the babes night. are out there going, what? You don't wear jewelry? Only right, for ladies? Date night. Date night, I'll wear jewelry. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, you know what? You do wear a lot of the New Beginnings necklaces, though. I've been, I've been oh, seeing you wear those. way more. Like, And I'm like, oh, my gosh, this looks so cute on you. But, yeah. The little scallop ring mm -hmm. that you were showing, Janelle, twenty nine dollars. Oh my gosh! This okay, little top one. so isn't it? Yeah, and so they're just fun. Mm -hmm. And again, um, a three stack, like for a thumb. Um, I, that's why I'm trying to do some of these singly, so mm -hmm. you can, you know, get them as thumb rings or, um, also as a bracelet guard. I mean, a ring guard. Sorry. So if you have some rings that are a little bit bigger, you always can push a smaller one there to kind of stack um some of your other rings so mm. i don't know if you ladies know that trick but say you know you lost a bunch of weight and your rings are a little floppy you can always just grab a smaller one and put it on the outside you know the, as the last ring and it okay. sure's in it's like oh it's the sphinx for the hand i you know i'm crazy about sphinx i'm thinking it's a sphinx for your hand yeah that's, that's it yes <laughs> I talked about oh, I talked about that during the show the other day. Oh my Joy. gosh! You don't have to do that anymore. We used to have to do that, Joy, but now they have Joey stretchy like, jeans. What are you talking about? Oh, yeah. so funny. Like, I am a seven. No, no, I'm like at ten, twelve, but yeah, no. It was funny. Yeah, Priscilla would like to know if you're going to be bringing <gasps> any crazy light bracelets in. Oh my gosh. Soon. Hun, I have so many beautiful crazy lights coming in and really exotic cuts and stuff. Nothing is coming in in a plain cut. It is, it, they're going to be beautiful. Um, of course, i got to bring more of the bird's nest type thing in, but oh, there's going to be, oh, wait a minute. You know what? There is a green reflections or is it Navelle? I, I did a lotus cut, big, big 12 millimeter, and I put some crazy lights. So there are some things coming sooner than later, too. Yeah. yeah. When you're done showing your look right oh, here, yes. Yes. we have a request for the coral. Ooh. The coral. Oh, this is the there camera. You go. No, I, I'm actually over here because that's the <laughs> other camera. The one that you're not using, Jill. Right here. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you love it? Like, um, but even if, just so you know, I will never get used to the camera angles. I'll always do it wrong. Yeah. <laughs> and then I'll have them behind me to, going. To make sure we have <laughs> expectations set. <laughs> yeah. Don't don't set your expectations too high for me, ladies. Please. <laughs> I'm, I'm good. I, I love to design jewelry. You could probably give me a good grade in that one, but not hosting. <laughs> so April was wondering. She said she missed the try on of the new uh, coral bracelet with the with the bar. Oh, and so good. She was wondering. Okay. If she'd like to see that. How that fits your wrist? Yes. Oh my gosh, I love That's this so style. Pretty. Matter of fact. As I was going over some of the luxury of Bali, this whole design itself, it's fabulous, ladies. So um, I am looking at bringing in some of that because it's just a great fit. It um, kind of fits like a bangle, but you get all that adjustability on it. 
So, how do you like that? And speaking of luxury at Brawley, we are closing the pre-sale on Sunday. So make sure to get your orders in for your pre-sale luxury Brawley items before Sunday. Oh my gosh, yes. There's, it's going to be kind of last chance on some of the rings. Because um, literally, if you've gotten one of the rings, I kind of might be doing a few little bracelets like this. So when you get your ring, I might bring just maybe two or three of the stones that are left. I might do in a style like this. I just gave it to Athena. I was like, oh, the ones that had chain link, I'm going to do the chain link. The ones that had like Tree of Life, Chanel Adair, I've already got the, the bracelet designed up. That's so fun. I want to do that. I can't so, wait. Yes. Sharon was asking if uh -huh. the, the coral is a more of a pink or red. This is definitely red. Yeah, this is definitely red. And sometimes with the white, you know, it, it's, it's kind of white, but sometimes it can look kind of pink because um, with the white. So this is definitely the white kind of, but it tends to sometimes go into kind of a pink hue sometimes, in my opinion. And Shirley said she was able to use the coupon. Thank you for that. <gasps> so then other people are like asking, what like coupon? <laughs> so we have... What coupon? Give me the code. Janelle 30. So... JKNYL30, okay. you will save $30 off a $175 purchase, excluding the new arrivals pre-sale or last chance. And don't forget my ring because of 30 years. Like, this is my favorite. I love thinking you ladies have, like, the same things as me. Um, It's my favorite, so I'm going to give three away Monday. I can't wait to see who. And what are we doing again? To get Anybody who purchases. purchases uh, oh, purchases. Yes. If you're purchasing for our new, like, show format. Yeah. Kind of fun. Yeah. So fun. Okay. And they were asking if it was a purchase from just the items we're showing. Just or any no. purchase for today. No, it should be anything. Any purchase today. Yeah, purchase I want today. anything. Yes. <laughs> there was a question. Yeah. So I'm to make sure yeah. you do. Any purchase. Yeah, so everybody's going to be buying their midi rings tonight. <laughs> <laughs> right? Yeah. Oh, I'm gonna, yeah. <laughs> well, the midis, oh my gosh, I'm going to be doing a presentation on some silver rings, the midis. I mean, we have so many things coming in, ladies. So, um, I th but this is going to give us an opportunity to kind of have a little bit of fun. And um, touring the items, I think it's so important because I want to show you the quality. But just kind of giving you an idea, um, you know, putting some of those things together. Becky said she just purchased the pendant that you're wearing. Oh, so okay. congratulations, because right. we're only two. So there's probably oh, no. Oh, no. That's right, because we're, like, retired with it. it looks so I know, I'm trying to look at, like, if there's any stones that were done. like, But, like, they're getting back to me saying, no, there's none. There's none. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because I'm like, well, just try just a few more times. Yeah. But they, I've really, like, um, pushed the limits. Right? Stop asking. <laughs> All right. Should we go to okay. Tray? So let. Oh wait, wait, wait. I did want to do one last thing yeah. too. Um, I did want to try on the roses um, necklace because I wanted to show you how cool. Now I have it on a magnet enhancer, but if you you got any of the roses necklace, to me like Tanzanite, you can't go wrong, right? And if you think of that tip to tip, oh, I like my favorite thing right now is wearing the Moissanite with the Tanzanite because I just you know I designed that bracelet with the Tanzanite and the Moissanite. Remember, it's that six stone, like, tip to tip. So, yeah, I love mixing those in together. They look so good together. Yeah, I'm going to have to put this um, with that other necklace next week. And Sheila Kelly was wondering, Janelle, yeah. if you can show the black spinal bracelet that you had earlier. Oh, is it the tip to tip probably? Um, and um, then also what I had, too. Ooh, this would be cool just in here, nice even, thing. right? Ooh, I like that. Oh, see, I would still keep it like this. So I had this one, but remember, I also had the um this that I had on with it too. So does that Oh yes. That is like gorgeous. that to me is like a really great look. Here, let me hook it. That way I can really there we go. So you kind of give you that like range of the look. The more oh yeah. And mm -hmm. Angelica That's one of you babes. <laughs> Angelica would like to see the ruby yeah. earrings on it. Oh yeah. Oh you know what? Do you sell them on the money? Oh yeah. how funny. I forgot. I forgot that they were yours. Yes. So, um, yeah. Oh, those look I so good. No, this is, these are the earrings. I'm like, I'm pretending because I remember, okay, there's a couple of girls around my office that wear these and I'm like, those look so good. 
They, they just look so good on mm -hmm. So I don't know if they look that good on me, but they look they good do. on that. They do. Yeah. And Christy says she received her labradorite beaded necklace and bracelet, <gasps> and the Chatoyance is amazing. Is it? Isn't it? Like, I, I thought it showed pretty good underneath, but in person, you're like, what? Yeah. Yeah, those will not happen again. 100%. Like, like, yeah. I was so excited. Mm -hmm. But and if you only knew to the price that they're selling for those for, mm -hmm. you'd be like, good job. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye. The necklace you were just wearing was the Tanzanite necklace, correct? Oh, yes, yes. The, the, the one with the roses. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that was the, the Tanzanite. Okay. Okay. Well, okay. here is my little trade that um, we're going to kind of show you just an overview. This is what we're going to kind of be going through. So what I think I'm going to do is try this look, stop, and then we'll sh tour after that. Is that cool? Okay. So, um, that way it kind of gives me a chance to layer up some of these really pretty looks for you ladies. All right. So I'm going to get better at it too because I'm like, oh, this came in, this came in. You know, I'll put things for the show. But now I'm going to be definitely... What would I wear today? <laughs> That's how we'll like do our shows. But I, I do like to sneak a few things onto the shows too, though, because again, when I do a show, that gives you the opportunity to, um, you know, have items on sale too. So, okay. Yeah. Well, first on my tray is this Prezio light ring. So we'll show that. light. I love this ring and this oh. the detail on the bezel. Okay, I had that on from the last tray. So yeah, there's two Prezio Light pieces that I have left. And I love that she was asking about the Prezio Light, but this is in the bird's nest. It's one of my favorite little rings. Mm -hmm. um, my girlfriend, Tracy, she's out there. Tracy Ruder Graham, tell her to say hello. Um, and yes, we do order every appetizer on the menu because we only <laughs> do it once a week. Um, and Or desserts, if we're at a really good oh, restaurant, mm -hmm. it's... And Joey knows that. Like, it, that's how he, we roll here. Um, <laughs> yeah. If they're doing creme brulee and there's some other, like, pretty much, I had a we're doing everything. I flavored one the other day. Coffee oh, flavored ooh, creme, creme brulee. Really good. And I'm so allergic to the milk and the egg, but I do it anyway. <laughs> and I love it. And that's our thing, right, Joey? It doesn't matter. Like, all around Paris, we were getting creme brulee, creme brulee. Like, yeah. It was amazing how many people do a bad creme brulee in Paris. <laughs> oh, that is interesting. Seems criminal. <laughs> yeah. Right, Joey? I know. That's one of his Randy favorites. Randy said she saw some fudge today, Janelle. A lot of you. Oh, my gosh. Oh, I'm yeah. truly cracking up. I feel so bad. My mom. You know, I just like mom. She got me Cracker Barrel fudge. Well, I'm thinking maybe they had it in a warehouse or something for a mm -hmm. mom. Oh, no. Because I was like, fudge. She knows I love fudge. Is salted caramel. Did Casey try it, Joey? No, I was laughing because I brought it into the office. It was and so Michelle good. And really I liked it. Oh my gosh, you liked it. <laughs> I liked it. Oh, I don't usually like fudge, which is funny. You know what? It's because you don't allow any sugar in your home at all. So when <laughs> it is there, you're like, it's so good. <laughs> I thought it was good. Oh my gosh, I was like the texture and that. I mean, I'm kind of a foodie though, maybe like in that sense. Okay, oh my gosh, Joey, that is. It. Somebody call Nanny right away and let her know. Because <laughs> my mom was like, um, I was like, I'm so sorry, mom. I, you know, because I didn't. She loves sweets. Yeah. So I'm like, you, oh, I'll come back and get it. So mom was going to come pick it up. Oh, well, it's in my car. I no, no, not that one. Not that one, because she got everybody one. So I thought she was spreading the love. Everybody got it. But maybe I just got a bad one. Because Cracker Barrel, like, yeah, isn't it good, authentic? We we don't have one around here. So if we travel and we see one, we stop. Because, yeah. Okay, uh, here we go. So everybody had a big conversation about this. So, yes. It literally is, um, you're like, what stone is it? Well, I put it with peridot because it's absolutely beautiful with peridot. It's beautiful with chrome. Um, but this is chrome chameleon. And wow. it is, it's just cut differently. So you're not going to get the other rainbow shades, but do you see how many shades of like lemons to greens that you get? Now, I, I had to move forward with it because I don't have... Um, one of the quartzes that does from an olive to a lemon to a peridot to, you know, all those really like almost like the teal, the green fluorite that we do too. 
Mm -hmm. Um, so it's spectacular. I did it in like an extra fancy cut. So just, you know, most people do not want to cut a long, uh, pair. Pear shapes are like one of those like marquees where everybody stays away from it. It's quite expensive usually to cut one of these. Mm -hmm. um, so it's going to be a one and done kind of collection, um, but it's really beautiful. So you're going to get the two stone pendant, the earrings. There is going to be a bracelet that's going to go with it. Um, I got to tell you, I'm doing this really beautiful Kingfisher, this natural, like beautiful white stone. It has... Um, it's almost like the um, the moss that grew Ooh. into it that was green. Um, oh, I think it'd be I really pretty with this too. We are down to four pairs <coughs> of the earrings. So wow. Those, wow. You ladies loved it. You loved it. And like, we do so want to elegant. see those on you, Janelle. Just oh, sure. Air. Okay. Oops, I'm taking yours, Tanya. <laughs> That's okay. <laughs> I got my whole tray of stuff. Just get your little mitts, mittens off that. Okay, so I'm, oh yeah, because they're so pretty on, mm -hmm. right? Oh, where's my, uh oh, <laughs> I lost my chain. Uh oh. It's my job to keep that chain here. Oh. But oh, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to put on the um, the necklace, the beaded necklace. Oh yeah. Because I think it's so beautiful. So um, if I'm going to be doing that, because what we'll do is after this, like we'll pause, okay? Mm -hmm. um, so I can try some of these things. Yeah. Oh, I, I love the beaded, like with the towel in front. Mm -hmm. Do you think that the chrome chameleon would be a good complement to the spoonie? Oh, it's got the yellow. Mm -hmm. got yellow yes, in and you know, I did find some more of that. So, um, yes, yes and yes, I'd say. Okay, I did two sizes in this bracelet too. So I'm gonna wear these, I'm gonna wear the peridot and the love one another. Um, as a looser bangle because I want to show you like how fabulous you saw the moise and I on me earlier that was fitted but I just love a little bracelet drape like mm -hmm. this okay love this what do we have left because the other peridots they come in they keep going please tell so me we've got we some had quantity. four sizes as of yesterday uh, we did have four so sizes pretty. so starting at a five inch wrist to a 7.75 Okay, nice, nice. Okay, probably not a lot, and I brought quantity in on this, but I'm going to tell you the peridot that I'm bringing, um, and it's also a checkerboard. You're not going to see the checkerboard. Like, nobody's cutting a fancy in this um, because they don't want to ruin the material. And that checkerboard on this is going to capture the light much better than a regular faceted and really kind of give you that prism of... The, you know, really those lemons to the, those gorgeous limes, you know? So pretty. It, it makes me literally want one of those, like, citrus kind of Slurpees. Okay. And then I think <laughs> Janelle's going to stack it with this. Love one another. Oh, and you're going to wear yours. Yours is going to be kind of more, like, loose. Like, you know, because you saw the um, the bracelet where she was able to wear the Moissanite fitted. Um, I wore the Moissanite uh, Love One Another fitted, and now you've got it looser like this, Tanya. Mm -hmm. So what is your favorite? Do you, um, I like fitted. You you like them fitted. Mm -hmm. So this t you don't wear them like this where I wear it like this constantly. Yeah, I would probably want it a little fitted, but actually I'm liking this together. Okay. It does look pretty together. Yeah. And yeah, because like with this one here, like see where this is – You've got kind of space on that. Mm -hmm. So to me, would you call that one fitted? This one I would say is fitted. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah. And that's really comfy. And well, then this one's probably roomy. Mm -hmm. And um, just, you know, if you don't mind flipping that over, um, the love one another I love because literally you can wear this as a tip oh, yeah. to tip. So remember with your love one another bracelet, you've got literally two in ones with that because I did the... The pattern of the watermark is from the inside to the outside. Um, but again, another one of my better bracelets. And when you ever look at the price that I have these for all the time, like you don't even need a discount. Mm -hmm. Like, trust me. You Unless they're going to be a show special. <laughs> and then they're $89. Oh. So we did a show special on the Love One Another. Okay. You didn't tell me this one tonight. No, I didn't. That's why I didn't say I anything. Surprise you surprise. Okay. Ladies, so get the love one another. Like my pendants, my rings are eighty nine dollars. Like this bracelet, um, if they're eighty nine tonight, you get two. You know mm -hmm. why? Because this is another one. You know I did that cable, a framing, a double framing bracelet. You wear one tip to tip. You wear one over. Um, it it is a great bracelet. 
And I wouldn't say two of every bracelet anymore, but like one like this, yes. Right? And we have a question from Tracy Ruder Graham. <gasps> yes, Miss Tracy. She would like to know what size Parado uh, bracelet is Tanya wearing. And Tanya has on the seven and a half. Okay, the seven and a half. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yep. There you go. And I'm a seven two five. My Perfect. wrist. Okay. Love it. All right. Do and we you're wanna... smart about that. Like, okay, so let's flip over to me, and I'm going to show uh, the earrings because you asked, and I can get like a nice little close up. You can. Yeah, I love it. Okay. And then, um, of course, you're seeing the matching pendant, but I do love an elongated pair, like from the top. Okay. And then look at that pair now. But you know how I said, like, this, I wear mine just a little bit more loose. Um, I love a bracelet stack like this. And these two, mm. the, yeah, this is your stack right here, ladies. I love so that. Beautiful. Those look so good together. And so comfy. So comfy. And I think, like, if you're looking for an entry bracelet, you've not done bracelets from you before, I think you will love these. I think this is, like, one of those, like, pieces that I would send you all day. And you'd be happy with them. And you're like, okay, starting with two. Um, but you'll love the bracelets again. Have you had much? Christy would like to know if you're um, going to be bringing in more Peridot, any rings or anything like oh, that. Oh, yes. The Peridot is, yes, we're having a moment with Peridot. So, um, yes, for sure. Um, and I actually did. I got some Peridot, recut the Peridot. So it, it, we might be doing a fancy one coming towards holiday. Um, so we're repurposing these stones into um, the long cushion, Ooh. the West East. Um, yeah, that is it's pretty. Tracy pretty Burris pretty. says everything looks so amazing when you, when, you, when you try it on. Oh, thank you. Well, I'm mirroring you ladies. <laughs> Sometimes I'll put my trays together because I've seen your post. <laughs> So thank you for being such a good stylist. And thank you for letting me design these. You know, because, you know, I love, to, you know, good quality things too. So um, I'm going to keep making you that good quality. So you keep loving loving what you're wearing, right? Yeah. Kay, you said you mentioned some Kingfisher coming in. Is yes. That, do you have a timeline on that? Um, I so happen to already plan it on a show. So, so um, in the next few weeks? Well, the sad thing, I got the bracelet, the tip to tip. Like, I'm grabbing that for myself. It's so elevated. Um, did the earrings? I actually did the earrings, too. So I think it's the bracelet and the earrings that are coming first. Mm. Yeah. So, yeah. Okay. It's going to be a classic. Like, to me, any chrome dog sides, like, yeah, there's going to be so many mm -hmm. things. <gasps> okay. Ooh, I'm going to have to put these earrings in. Um, so I kind of showed you the first look. And now we're going to go into a little bit of the watermark because... Um, to me, that might be a conservative stack that I have on. So, ladies, you know I love, like, a little bit of edge. So, um, I think these earrings and the ring. Oh, hi, Shogos. Hi, Shogos. Um, is, I, I love these. It's like a two-in-one earring. And the, yeah. I think they're just, like, I, I just love that. Because you get that really contemporary high-polished silver. And then... The watermark, and do, if you see the texture, like when you go to the front to the back, I've knife edged them. They're two pieces that I put together. Perfection. Like my artisans, the watermark on this is exceptional. The, the quality, mm -hmm. right, Tanya, when you, you pick them up, you're yeah. like, wow. I mean, instantly you know that these are like some quality earrings here. Um, I, I do. I put a lot of love into my silver pieces because I just love silver, you know? Just love the silver. Um, it, it's definitely pieces, you know, I want to create those classics. I know how important they are in my clothing wardrobe. So my thing is to really create those really classic silver pieces that mm -hmm. you will just kind of like use all the time. Like they're your go-tos, you know, cause I have those days where I just, ugh, right. To put something, to pick something in your wardrobe. It's like, yep, I had too many, um, too many cakes this week, you know, so <laughs> And it, you probably didn't gain weight, but in your head, you think you did. So you put your all silver set and out you go, right? Mm -hmm. And you look great. But we have those those days um, when your mind is telling you something that's not true. 
<laughs> you put on your awesome silver sets mm -hmm. and then feel great for the day because somebody will be like, wow, that's really cool. You know, yeah. something different. And I love this ring. And when I'm doing some yeah. of the show specials, I try and pick things that will fit a variety of people. And I love that it's adjustable. And so I picked it as a show special. Oh, you did? Okay. I did. I don't know what she does. I'm kind of like, <laughs> she loves to surprise me. And you, you know, I'm kind of like, oh, I'm so glad. Yeah. $49. So I didn't know. Okay. For the adjustable reference. Yes. And ladies, I hope it over delivers. I love, love when new people find us and then they order a piece like this and they're like, what? Remember, do you ladies remember your first piece that you got from me? They're like, it seems to be looking pretty good. Is she's touring that? Maybe I'll try one. Right. Mm -hmm. And now we're like in our forever family together. Right. And mm -hmm. it's like, how can we do more and lower the price down so you can get this one too? <laughs> so that is our job to always constantly try to pick some really great pieces we know and especially too Michelle knows there's pieces that are like my favorites and this is the ring that yeah when we first did it this is the first uh reorder of it though so we actually have the sizes stocked we do mm -hmm. but I do like with the adjustability that way if you're a half size or you know it's just every one like my pointer finger is one size different from my thumb so I can adjust that and wear it on my thumb if I want to be kind of more edgy. Yes, we love that deep. We love to be, we have to be edgy every once in a while, right? Yeah. Like yeah. that's where it's like, you know, appropriately, like sometimes maybe I can't be edgy with some of the other things, but with jewelry, you can. <laughs> yeah, this is bracelet of the week that Tanya's touring. Yeah. Chain link. Uh, oh, yes, 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 yes. yes. Oh, with lots it. more sizes added because I never had, um, it was, that's why it took us so long to get it back in. But what sizes do we, we have? We have actually? six sizes available, Ooh. starting at a 4.25 inch wrist. Yes. To I did an little. eight inch wrist. Yeah. So there will be a fit in there for you. Yeah. That's, mm -hmm. a, light, that's a little baby. I know. <laughs> yeah. No. I think that's. But yeah. It's like, yeah, some people like, and it's so funny because you never like, you know, some people just have really small, small wrists, right? And I think that's one of the first bracelets I've seen you do down to a four and a quarter. Yeah. We don't have a lot of them, so mm -hmm. it's nice. Yeah. A lot of times, you know, we're, um, you know, probably the next bracelet that's really good for that too would be if you kind of go into that four inch is all of my little um, topaz, three stone pear shaped bracelets. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. The smallest one is so good. That That is, that is a good Kirsten one. Michelle, I know that's like she's, mm -hmm. it was really cool when I meet some of you ladies. She just commented, thank you so much for the small size. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah. It was, I was like, I, it was exciting when I get to meet you ladies or see um, you posting that it's like, oh my gosh, somebody really wanted that or needed that. And and great mom too. So great. She loves the baby size. She's bracelets. tiny. Well, she wants more baby size rings too. And, and bracelets. So yeah, yeah, it's something that I've got to start to work, you know, mm -hmm. I, I've inundated with so many new styles though, that like adding in a smaller, like some of the rings. Yeah, but oh, beautiful, beautiful. Okay, yeah. so the green reflections, we're going to be going into that now. And I got to tell you, I already showed all this, right? So, I the love one another with the peridot stack. I don't know. Yeah. Amberly, she has been channeling this her peridot for a week straight, and she keeps adding more bracelets to her stack. So, yeah, I, I love that Amberly, she knows those, those gemstones to like hop on. And the peridot definitely is one of those. Mm -hmm. um, the green reflections is just so pretty paired back with the peridot though. So I could have left the peridot bracelets on it and paired all these back and they would have been beautiful. Oh, yes. And um, guess what? The bracelet of the week um, is that perfect, perfect pairing with this too. Mm -hmm. So um, again, you, you could fit into three sizes even on that, that bracelet of the week. Um, and I, I love this because this has the beads and it, it's not very often like bracelets like this are kind of like my necklaces or, um, the ones that actually cost a lot more, but I don't do a lot of them. And I always put a really, really great low price on them. Um, because these are the ones that in the jewelry industry, like the, just the engineering part of this to get it to lay and fit right. Um, so cool though. Um, and I just, I love the chain link because, you know, you think of some of the softer stones. Sometimes I do, you know, like frangipanis and stuff, but I love the chain link because it literally 
mirrors the hand woven chain. Oh, yeah. So it's neutral. So like to me, I, you know, my chain link, I kind of categorize as not really a pattern because literally, you know, I do so many of the bracelets that are the hand woven chain that will go back, back to them, you know? This one does lay beautifully with the bracelet of the week. Mm. So pretty. Okay, so I think I'm, I've got to find that necklace. Oh, there, I think it's right there. And then we have the ring as well. Ooh, I love the style on the band here. This is one that I haven't seen before. And the ring we have available in sizes 5 through 12. Yeah. Awesome. And it goes east to west. <laughs> Beautiful. Okay, so I've got this. And I am going to put on... Um, but the green reflections, it's so pretty because as you saw Tanya moving that gemstone around, um, the colors of mm -hmm. the blues and the aquas. And um, yeah, I mean, to me, it's just that really vibrant, just really beautiful um, stone. But from the side view, like where I'm standing next to Tanya, Tanya's actually next to me showing the jewelry. It is this gorgeous turquoise, like sea, oh, yeah. you know, Caribbean waters. Like it only produces it from a side angle, which I cannot mirror it that well on under the camera. But yeah, get in the light and somebody's going to be t thinking you've got this like royal blue, like waters. Kind of oh, yeah. like the Bali Breeze color. I can kind of catch that color when I turn it to the side. Yeah, little flashes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's, you know, it's just one of those pieces that, ooh, I'm, you know what, the next earrings, did I actually show these? Ooh, these are cute on. Did yeah. I show those I don't on? think we've shown them on yet. Oh, yeah, I think I'm going to have to show those. Those are very cool. Okay, um, oh, and, I got a little mirror by my neck. <laughs> Joey had some feedback. They said nice uh, top and Janelle into the screen. So oh, yeah. Did. Oh, he did? Oh, did you just we do that? We did in the corner. I'm over here in the mirror going, oh, these are cute. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's so funny. Yeah. Right. So I don't know what he did, but they liked it. Okay, it was a good one, Joey. Yeah. So, so those pendant is about two and a half inches. Okay. And Lisa Saruga, we have Tanya hand modeling tonight. Tanya. Yes, Tanya is here. Like we don't get her, like she is so busy doing all the photos and putting them on the website, this and that. But uh, with this new fun format that we decided to show tonight, like um, she, and also too, we're, we're, you know, looking to expand our team a little bit because I wanted to be able to hang out with you guys. Um, a little bit and touring the jewelry, talking. Uh, oh, Lisa Saruga's here, and mm -hmm. and then every once in a while I get to see the um, names. So <laughs> I'm really excited about. I'm just excited about that part of the show because this is what I wanted. Oh, Louise. Oh yeah, there you are. So Nancy Lee has a question. She wasn't seeing any size options mm -hmm. on the green reflections bracelet. So the oh the lobster no or sorry the toggle bracelet comes in one size. Yes, it does. A six seven five. And then the, the tip fit. to tip, oh, the, on the six, I think five, she's asking for the fit. The fit on the toggle is going to fit a five, seven, five to a seven and a half inch wrist. Okay. And we'll check the website on that one and make sure that maybe she was saying the website doesn't have it. Um, because that bracelet, but the, when you see the toggles, it fits a lot of people, which, you know, I love. Mm -hmm. And the tip to tip will fit a five and a half to an eight inch wrist. There's four different size options. Oh, okay. You know what I love about this is that with the green reflections, literally like with the outfit that I'm wearing, um, well, I mean, maybe it's like black. You can wear everything with it, but um, really a channeling, this gorgeous blue. Um, man, that would be really pretty to wear the green reflections like with your blues. Ooh, yeah. You know, because it does kind of pop that, that color out. But Mystics, the lighter Mystics, because the faceting I do are like competition cut. It's like, if they say it's 100 facets, we're going to do 200. So, but most of my competition cut ones are like 300 to 350 facets. Um, so it really will pick up color saturation around you too. Mm -hmm. um, you know, all my quartzes and my topazes that I cut for you. All right. I think... Okay, show it on you? so I have my final look. So I took those earrings off because Joey did a sneaky peek when I had those on. So I, I moved into the green reflections. But, um, you know, I really kind of have done collections where, again, you know, I like to buy in full sets. So I'm trying to design things that you could wear like this together. Because, like, if you have a stone, like, you, like, 
for example, Brendy Hahn loves pre-night. <laughs> so <laughs> she will get like multiple things. You know, when you find that color that just speaks to you in a gemstone, which I know, ladies, they do, right? Because that's how I select and cut my gemstones. They do. They just, you know, the, the colors, it, it is. Like to me, it's like that healing of the, that that color, that sensation to your, to your eyes. Um, so, yes. So there's this little one too, but you don't have to do this. But these, you saw Tanya, they have the cute little bees, which I just love. That's what brought me to Bali. And that's what brought me to you is the Bali bees. So... Um, whenever I do those pieces, I, I, I get kind of excited. Lots of gratitude, you know, for being here with you today. And, um, you know, I always say, God, you know, God's brought me uh, to this place. So thank you for joining the journey with us. So question uh -huh. you, yeah. Junie Butt was asking if, Junie you, Butt. Junie Butt, if you could please try on the oval earrings. Yeah. Oh, sure. Mm. Ooh, look at this. Yeah, we're going to figure this out. Um, with the okay. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> We're definitely going that way. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that is so hilarious. Okay, so this is going to be really fun too because you know I want to spend more time and talk about some of the pieces and stuff. So we probably will be showing a little bit less, right? Um, so that way we can spend the time try try them on and things like that too. Maybe we might need to get a model. <laughs> because I'm like, look how long that took. <laughs> um, I do like these. I put a little bit, a few extra extender rings. I did them originally, and I was like, I wanted a little bit more of a swing to them. So you're going to see, like, when on the website, if you look at it, there's extra rings. Because with opal, like, you get that prism of color. So as you're in the light and moving, I wanted, I wanted people to see that. Look at, oh, this is the first time I'm seeing out the window. Look, at, I have two naughty kitties out the front. Get back in your yard. Oh, oh, in the that. backyard. Yeah. Okay. That's funny. And uh, Ola said, you mentioned earlier we were talking about Peridot. You're going to be bringing in some oh, Peridot. Oh, yes, yes. We have and more. you've mentioned in the past not doing as many earrings. But is Peridot something that you would consider doing a pair of earrings? <sighs> okay, so we were really working. A COVID kind of, like, I notice a difference in our ear wires and I want a better quality ear wire. So I've started to retire the French levers. So the earrings, we've been kind of lowering the price to do that. I'm really working on a better one. Um, I probably am gonna bring some of my old school wires kind of in in some of the other ones. But um, what happens is we tend to bring things in um, and then sometimes we only are gonna bring three in. So I will try to bring earrings, make sure that we bring things in on different ones. But um, Ola, would you like like a stud or like a, you know, like a long dangle? Because we, we still have some of these and I'm really pricing them accordingly, but they used to before crew would be a lot thicker and it's really hard to get anybody to actually make this in, in the first place. So um, it, it's kind of funny that we're this many years out and now we're still feeling some of the effects of what happened during that time. So um, if it's not going to be the best, um, eventually I'll just continue. Um, but Peridot earrings, I hear that, but give me some feedback. And on, on our paperwork, you know, sometimes I can see if a bracelet is coming or another yes. piece is coming. I do not show a bracelet for the newer cut on the chrome chameleon. And Teresa Stevenson was oh. asking if there's going to be a bracelet in that. Oh, my goodness. I don't see one. Okay, you know so what? We can check and let her Actually, I, you know what? As I was designing some things, I might have actually done it with the, okay. the Kingfisher. Because you know how it came in? Oh, okay. I wonder if I did it for that. Okay. I'm just kind of wondering if I... I'll double check and I'll get back to Tracy. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So it was one of those like try me stones where we do like a pocket collection. So if it was in pocket. But I know, is that unheard of? Chanel doesn't design not making a bracelet usually. Right. That's insanity. Joey. <laughs> okay. Um, well, anyway, I think we got through yeah. everything. And I want to thank you so much. And uh, everybody that was here helping out tonight. So I'll have to uh, come back and watch and see how we can make that better, too. But uh, Mickey is saying we've got spins to do. Oh, we got more spins. guess what? We're giving away three $10 certificates um, because you made comments tonight and you were part of our new show. 
So right. here we go. Here's number one. We, we have <gasps> Mariel Smith. Morel. Oh, wow. Wait a minute. She's, She's Australia. Morel. Oh my gosh. I saw her post today too. Like, oh my gosh, Morel. Love you, girl. That is so awesome. Okay. Oh. Amberly Miller. Oh my gosh. I love it. Amberly. And one more. Okay. April. April Preen. Oh my gosh. My other amazing April. Yeah, the, the two original April. So congratulations to the three winners. Yes, and congratulations. Okay. Not even email. Yay. Get it right to their account here. So oh, wonderful. Nice. Okay. Well, we're gonna get that off to you right away. So don't forget, like, um, literally Monday we will. Um, if you're purchasing anything till eleven fifty nine tonight, um, you're gonna get in the drawing for my diamond ring. Okay. Look at that. Um, so anyway, so you'll be twinning with me. Um, we're I'm going to give three this way because it's literally our anniversary month still. So, um, three and three. So three, like diamonds, three rings. Um, and also two, um, we'll be getting you those other coupons and next week is a shorter week. Okay. So please join us. We have a, a show on Monday that Michelle's going to be doing, and then we're going to have one big finale on Wednesday as I'm giving my team, um, off on Friday. Okay. They're going to have a little, they've earned it. They've done such a good, I know. So it was like an, an extra paid day because they just worked so hard and um, we're going to give them some time off. Okay. And then what? Yes. I yes. More announcements. Yeah. Wait, yeah. Don't, <laughs> don't, announcements. don't forget anything else. Okay. Highlight. Here I go. <laughs> Back again for the show tonight. We're going to be yeah. looking at that next week, so you can send that to contact us. And with this being closed on Friday, allow a few extra days for contact us for because we're here oh, team yes. to get back to you next Ooh, week. Because good will announcement. Be a little behind yeah. coming on Monday. So yeah, yeah. So it is. It is um, because yes, yeah. we'll be have be closed for so long. And it's normally one to three days. Usually around that one day, I would imagine they're going to be around that three days. You know, I'm like, what am I going to do? It was so funny. Tracy's like, what do you plan? I said, I didn't even realize it, like, it came so quick with the holiday. I have no plans at all. I have nothing. So she's like, we'll go have coffee. So I said, okay. Because I'm like, I'll start working. <laughs> Extra time off. Yay. They're not in the, the, the brand buys. I'm going to redo stuff. Like, <laughs> Surprise, you're back. I created all new stuff for you. Oh. Right. Everybody's so laughing because they're like, so that is so no. funny. <laughs> we also are going to send out a survey. So if you uh -huh. participated tonight, please make sure to look at your email. It's it's a survey about the show, so just let us know. But also, please reach out to contact us. But just as much feedback as we can get, we would love it. And yeah. I got to thank you. I want to thank my team. So like they worked so hard on doing this new format. I'm, there's going to be some tweaks, but. Expectation will Janelle will never be great up here doing this. Um, but any feedback you can give. Okay, but we we love that you joined us tonight. And we will see you Monday and Wednesday for sure. Okay. Have a great weekend. Okay. Blessings your way. <laughs>